Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 581. Where we have 50 moves to collect three ingredients. The ingredients are going to come from up here and we have to get them down here, but we've got frosting and licorice locks in the way. Now I don't mind keeping this up here for a little while because I want to make moves against this frosting. And what I want to do is kind of clear out the center area once I've done that, then I can start working on bringing the ingredients down. I've got 50 moves, so I've got a lot of time to do this, actually. I don't think that this is a very hard level. I just uh, needed to play through it once and really get a good feel for it and see how things would operate. And what I learned is that at about move 36 is when I get my next ingredient. And then 21 is when I get my third ingredient, assuming that I haven't collected any other ingredients before then. All right, so I like to open up these licorice locks when I can. I've got a lot of red here, and it feels like it should match into something. So let's try to make that happen here. There we go. I was going to use those orange together. Now this is coming down, but that's okay because it's going to be on this conveyor belt. And I'm making uh, some progress through here. And actually, if I can just make a stripe up here, then I can uh, clear this out if I can get the ingredient around this way. Or I can just drop this straight through. Oh, look at that, but it's going to take it away on the conveyor. I got my stripe I wanted. Let's go ahead and set it off right now and clear this area out too. We've got a little extra a margin here to deal with this stuff. Okay, so now it's move 37. Let's double check. So no new ingredient came down, but now it's move 36, and I think a new ingredient is scheduled to come down. I want it to be right in the center. There we go. If I move this, that's going to drop this down. And I have this here, but I just don't trust it. So I have to be careful now that when I make these moves, I, I consider all of the different parts of the board here. I could do this. I'm actually going to do this. I don't mind if this comes down right here because it's still towards the center. Ah, but now I have to get this off of the conveyor belt before it goes too far. Eh, it's kind of okay if it goes too far, isn't it? And maybe I can get a purple in through here. Because if it goes too far, what happens is it just travels back onto this conveyor. I'm not really out much. Uh, I've still got those 32 moves. So I'm going to be okay with that. I've got these other things that I might be able to make, but I still think I want to go for a color bomb here. Color bombs can be so handy. Now, I could make this stripe here, but then I lose this. I'm going to hold off. I, I, you know, I see this coming through and I can just about get there. And that might cause another color bomb too. Okay, so here we go. We're going to do this and maybe get a yellow through here. Well, the yellow didn't work. Okay, so I think we're going to do this now. Clear things out, make some space. I've got this next ingredient coming round. Got this one right here. Let's see what I can do. I've got a group of yellow. What can I do to make this yellow work together? Well, there we go. That's really nice. I'll go ahead and make this stripe, although I'm not planning to use it here, and it doesn't matter because it's going to be taken out anyway. Oh, I've got another stripe right here. And now remember how I said move? 21 should be it. So let's see what happens if I do this. Oh, I th really thought we were going to get that other ingredient. I guess it's move. Oh, I was on move 22. This is move 21. Yeah, I have a little trouble with numbers. Okay, so now I've got some really cool things happening. I've got these ingredients stacked up here. I've got this one kind of right where I want it. And I've got these two guys right here. So watch the explosiveness that happens with the striped wrapped combo. I really thought it was going to take everything out. I'm surprised it took this one out and left the others. But that's okay because I've got 18 moves. These are lined up over something 
that I should be able to take care of pretty quickly. All I need to do is match it with a yellow. Now I understand that yellow isn't volunteering over here yet, but I also have so many other opportunities that I don't think I need to worry too much. I'm making all these stripes and stripe draft combos as well. I think we're going to be able to take care of this. I can't quite get that. And this is pretty funny that I've got all of these. Oh no, I can't watch. I'll use this over here and it'll take these guys out. So I think that this is a relatively easy level. The reason I lost the first time around is I was too concerned. I was concentrating too much on when those ingredients were going to come in. And so I wasn't looking at the best opportunities. Also, I um, made a move. I wasn't careful and I made a move that dropped an ingredient down right here. And it just kind of languished there. I didn't have enough moves to take it out entirely. I also got more... Um, specials on this board this time around and some of that is I was paying more attention and some of that is a little bit of luck. If you'd like to see more videos you can subscribe. If you have any questions put this in the comment section and as always thanks for watching.